Our Phil Archer was able to fly in this vintage airplane. It is a Ford Trimotor, also nicknamed the Tin Goose. You can see why it's named that. It's an American three engine transport aircraft that made it back. It was made back in the 1920s. Phil is joining us now with a closer look at this piece of history. Phil. Yeah, you know, three engine airplanes went out of style with spats, but one of the few Ford Trimotors still flying is visiting Houston this weekend, giving everybody a chance to see just what it's like to soar on an 89 year old icon as we did this afternoon. It was called the Tin Goose, or sometimes the Flying Washboard, but it is the plane that gave birth to commercial aviation in America, the Ford Trimotor. First introduced in 1926, the vision of Henry Ford, who wanted three engines so passengers would feel safe if one of them quit. This one, owned by the Experimental Aviation Association of Wisconsin, is visiting the city this weekend. It's at the West Houston Airport where folks are lining up for 15-minute rides. This is a special machine. This has a lot of history. The Trimotor was introduced in 1926, built of wood and corrugated aluminum. Its range is only about 300 miles, but that was enough to make commercial air travel a reality. When this airplane was first introduced, it was high technology and high style. For those of us today, the thing that most stands out is just how incredibly loud it is. It doesn't zip through the air so much as waddle with a cruising speed of only about 110 miles an hour. Pilot Steve Lambrick says it's more like driving a truck than a sports car. It's a pleasure to fly. It's a, it's a different challenge, but um, no, not, not light and nimble or sporty. It's, 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 you're, you're working it. The Ford Trimotor dominated the air for less than a decade before better, faster planes came along. But even though it flew into history long ago, something about it still speaks to us today. I've had so many people just say that was the, the best thing I've ever done or that was a bucket list item. And, and it's always fun because they always get excited to be here. Yeah, it's off my bucket list now. The Trimotor is going to be here at West Houston Airport through Sunday. Tickets for adults are $70 for kids under 17, uh, $50. So keep them flying. Reporting live in West Harris County, I'm Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News.